and welcome to our 12 Gifts of Divine Candlelight Service. Let's just open in prayer. We take a breath. We take that breath of life. And we say, thank you, Mother, Father, God, for this opportunity to come together to celebrate the rebirth that is alive within each of us as we shift our consciousness, as we shift our lives, being guided by that inner wisdom and allowing divine order and imagination, faith, strength, love, power, understanding and will, elimination, zeal, and life to flow through each and every one of us, allowing us to be the consciousness of change in our own lives, in the lives around us, and in the world. And we give thanks for these gifts, and so it is. Amen.
practice too much. I got lighter. <laughs> ah. It's a little snafus. So now we are going to begin the service by doing our prosperity affirmation. So we give love and light. We take our gifts into our hands. And we bless it as the ushers come forward. Together, divine love through me blesses and multiplies all that I am, all that I have, all that I give, and all that I receive. Together away in nature. Today we celebrate the birth of babe Jesus in Bethlehem. We also celebrate the birth of the Christ in us. So let us rejoice in the birth of a new spirit in us, a new love, faith, joy, and light, with peace shining wherever we are. Spiritual rebirth is a progressive process. Just as Jesus Christ came to the world as a baby that had to grow and become the perfect man, so the birth of the Christ Spirit in each of us is but the beginning of the journey toward our spiritual perfection. The Christ nature is formed in us and perfected in us as we learn to give expression day by day. 
Today there is rejoicing in the world because of the birth of Jesus Christ. Today there is rejoicing in your heart because of the birth of the Christ Spirit in you. The power and faculties of a newborn Christ transforms you and blesses you and enriches your life. Christ is your fulfillment. Christ is born in you this day. How would be the divine presence within you? I bring the gift of faith. From our innermost being, we give to the world our gift of faith. This is the faith that knows God is the true essence of everything. Our faith is unshakable. We know God is the power at work in every situation. Our faith acknowledges all people everywhere. You are the Christ, the son and daughter of the living God. You are God's dearly beloved. This candle represents Peter, our gift of faith, in the presence and power of God active in the universe. I bring the gift of strength. From our innermost being, We give to the world our gift of strength. Christ is our strength. In the midst of confusion, we trust in God. We acknowledge our patience and steadfast in truth. We hold in prayer for all people everywhere that they have the inner resources and strength to do what is theirs to do. God is our refuge and your strength. With God, all things are possible. We hold the high watch for others. This candle represents Andrew, the spiritual strength we bring to our world. I bring the gift of divine wisdom. From our innermost being, we give to the world the gift of wisdom. Divine wisdom is being established in all people everywhere. May each person develop the ability to make wise decisions, to remember and to retain needed information, to put things in proper perspective, to weigh options, and to make right choices. This gift comes from our hearts in our minds and flows freely into God's great world. This candle represents James, our gift of divine wisdom for all. Glory in the highest 
unconditional love. <laughs> From our innermost being, we give to the world the gift of our love. As God's creation, we are important and are needed to fulfill our particular niche in life. No one else can express God's love as we do. We acknowledge God's love in action through us. We bless others through us. We bless others through our gift of love. This candle represents John, the spiritual love we send forth into our world. I bring the gift of power. From our innermost being, we give the world the gift of power. The powerful affirmation of the truth of God is our gift to the world this Christmas season. Through the power of the Christ within, we bless the world. We release this power in positive ways, uplifting, creating, liberating, and enlightening as we speak. We affirm only good. We affirm only love. We affirm only peace. This candle represents Philip, the one power and presence of God on earth. I bring the gift of imagination. From our innermost being, we give the world the gift of imagination. We imagine a world full of love. We imagine a world full of peace. We imagine everyone well fed. We imagine every home prospered. We imagine every one reaching his or her full potential. We imagine all people realizing that they are God's beloved and living in accordance with this truth. This candle represents Bartholomew, our ability to imagine heaven on earth. We have heard on high, sweetly singing o'er the plains and the mountains in reply, echoing their joyous strains. Gloria in excel 
Understanding. From our innermost being, we give the world the gift of understanding. We recognize there are many troubled situations in our world, and to these situations we give understanding. The foundation of our world is God, and we give strength to that foundation by our understanding. We acknowledge the good active in our lives. We give thanks to the perfect, full expression of the Christ's presence within all people. We affirm divine understanding for all. This candle represents Thomas, our understanding that God is the source of truth, and guidance in all situations. I bring the gift of divine will. From our innermost being, we give to the world the gift of our will. We let go of our small egos. We relax our hold on earthly demands. We let go of tension and stress. We know that God is in charge of this world, and we give to that, the world, our willingness to let God's perfect will be done. We acknowledge that God's will for all people is good and only good. This candle represents Matthew, our will. We turn our will over to God and let God's will be done. I bring the gift of order. From our innermost being, we give the world the gift of order. We realize there is no situation or need 
that the divine order of God cannot harmonize, adjust, or make right. Our trust in God establishes divine order. We are in tune with the infinite. Our gift of order establishes itself in its proper timing and perfect peace. All confusion and disorder are dissolved. The presence of God is active in the world in an orderly, peaceful, and loving way. This candle represents James the Lesser, our dedication to divine order in our world. Bring the gift of zeal. From our innermost being, we give to the world the gift of our zeal. Our joy, enthusiasm, and zeal bring a spark into the world. The Spirit of God uplifts and sustains us. Whatever the need, the Spirit of God lifts us up and all is fulfilled. We celebrate the joy and enthusiasm that bubbles up and bursts forth into the world, bringing the everlasting gift of God's good. This candle represents Simon, the joy we send forth through the power of our spiritual zeal. I bring the gift of renunciation. From our innermost being, we give to the world the gift of our renunciation. Our world is cleansed, and as we release all that no longer serves us through the power of the indwelling Christ, with one clean sweep, the power of the Christ frees us from mistaken ideas and makes room for the higher concepts of truth. Hurts of past, misunderstandings, and sorrows are washed away. We release all unforgiving thoughts and feelings. We let go of the past. We establish a new and fresh beginning. 
This candle represents Thaddeus, our gift of renunciation to the world as we release all that no longer serves us. I bring the gift of a healthy life. From our innermost being, we give the world the gift of life. We acknowledge that every phase of life has its divine purposes. We rejoice each day in the new ideas, discovery, revelations, and involvement of the day. We bring the awareness of spiritual life to every part of life. We bless the people, the animals, the planet, and all living things. We give thoughts of pure, vibrant health and revitalizing life to every area of our own life and to every area of the lives of others. This candle represents Judas, the gift of life in our world.
I invite you to become still. Just close your outer eyes if you're comfortable with that. And just to be, be in that space of love. Be in the 12 faculties, these 12 gifts of the divine. as we just move into that heart space. At Christmas time, perhaps more than any other time during the year, it's good to take time to be still, to quiet our thoughts, to let go of anxiety, intention. It is at this time of stillness, of meditation and prayer, that will make the shopping a joy. Make our planning easy and bless everything we do during the Christmas season. We are truly blessed at this Christmas time with the light and understanding. Our prayer is that the glory of God may shine around, around us and illuminate our way and that it shines and radiates around all all beings, all spirit of life and guides the way for peace and love to prevail. We pray that the light of God may shine so brightly in our hearts and in our lives that no trace of darkness shall remain. We pray that in the heaven of our minds, the angel song is heard, that in the cradle of our heart, the Christ is born. We pray that we may partake of the wonder and the glory of Christmas, that this Christmas may be an unforgettable experience. We are blessed. We are filled with light. Our whole being is radiant with light. We see our world bathed in the holy light of spirit. We are transformed. The world is transformed.
And let us give thanks now for a joyous, peaceful, prosperous Christmas season and New Year. And we say thank you for these gifts, the divine gifts of life. And so it is. Amen. Standing before you are a wonderful group of people who represented represented for us the 12 disciples of Jesus Christ. The disciples of the Jesus teachings will now illumine our own individual lives as we light our candles. I invite you to stand and light your candles. our candles to the light to the joy to the peace that's guiding each of us on this beautiful night during this beautiful season of Christmas knowing that the Christ is alive in you and in everyone in the world. And so it is. Amen.
Happy New Year. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Let your heart be light. From now on, our troubles will be out of sight. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Make the Utah.